and he has given me the authority tonight to make any match I would like. I'm not nuts, I might be from Glasgow, but I'm not nuts. I want you and you in a handicap match. Hopefully he just put himself Both in a, a two-on-one handicap. Just to show that there's no hard feelings, Travis Banks. Next week, it's going to be you and Austin Aries for the Defiant Championship. Ridgeway. Or maybe a double foot stop. Primate got him. Oh, Primate! Primate, Rene gets you! And he rings the, the bell! Referee rang the bell! Here is your winner, and still Defiant Wrestling Hardcore Champion, the Primate! Hey, I'm not too sure that Chris Ridgeway did tap out. That was a quick, quick call. But the official decision, whether they like it or not, is that Primate retains the hardcore title via tap out, and maybe, just maybe, Defiant Wrestling has struck, struck a blow back against IPW. A huge night here on Defiant Wrestling as our champion, the so-called greatest man that ever lived, Austin Aries, defends the belt against the Kiwi buzzsaw, Travis Banks. All happening this week here on Defiant. Dave Bradshaw here at ringside with James R. Kennedy and James, as well as a world title match, we have much, much more coming up as well. We absolutely do. Big confrontation, huge confrontation. Speedball Mike Bailey and Drake. Personally, you know I can't wait for that. I have a personal interest in that with Drake. It's going to be a big, big night of action. Well, with no further ado, let's take it to the ring and get things started. Now here's a man we haven't seen for quite some time. Last time we saw him, he was carrying Prince Amin out of here. Modern contest, this is singles match set for one fall. This match has a 20 minutes time limit. Come to the ring at this time. From the Netherlands, we're in tonight at 121 kilos. This is yours. Simmons! Jörn Simmons accompanied by Eva and Slater. Uh, wait a minute. Hang on. They have come. Oh, there what? he is! That's Prince Amin! Why is Prince Amin? And look at what he's wearing, Bradshaw! Amin has that same dead look in his eyes that Liam Slater has. Well, you have to ask the question. As Prince Amin, is this Gabriel Kidd's worst nightmare? Prince Amin may have been converted by Pastor William Eber. What is... What's happening there? Eber handing Amin's crown, that headwear, to Liam Slater. Well, Pastor William Eber, he's sure <laughs> attracting the numbers, isn't he? This is a rapidly growing congregation, if you can call it that, for Pastor William Eber. I can't believe Prince Amin is out here with these guys. Oh, what, what is happening? What is going on with Prince Amin? And again, Bradshaw, he dressed up for the occasion. What is happening here? Well, here comes Jörn Simmons' opponent, but I'm still baffled at the presence of Prince Amin. Whoa! His opponent from Wakefield, England, winning tonight. And 260 pounds, Luke Menzies! So Luke Menzies is going to challenge Jörn Simmons and I do not envy Menzies, or, who despite the fact he's a very finely tuned young athlete, he is going to have it all to do here against this monster of a man from the Netherlands. Well, Jörn Simmons doesn't look as though he's sweating. Luke Menzies, Menzies is a very big man. But again, Bradshaw, the numbers out here. This is unbelievable, Pastor William Eber. He, he's 
he's sure doing some big things here in Defiant Wrestling. I still can't believe that Prince Amin is before our very eyes with these men. Uh, Amin, the reputation with the Defiant fans for being happy-go-lucky, a great guy to be around, but there is absolutely no joy left in that face. What has happened to Amin since he was carried out of here a few weeks ago by Jern Simmons? Master William Eva putting the mean into Prince Amin, and you have to wonder what Gabriel Kidd will think when he claps eyes on this. Well, trying to pay attention to the action here, but Amin and Eva and Slater are standing off just to our left. It's hard to take your eyes off this new Prince Amin we're seeing. Menzies, look at that power. I don't think Simmons was expecting that. Oh, this is just two rugged big men going toe to toe. Jörn Simmons, another here in Defiant Wrestling who wants competition. Jörn Simmons with a shoulder block. Menzies did not go down. He's put together as Menzies. Might not be the uh, walk in the park that Pastor William Eva was hoping for for his, this uh, member of his flock, his congregation, Jörn Simmons. I don't know about that. Maybe Eva wanted to test Jörn Simmons. He certainly tested all of us by recruiting Prince Amin. Look at these shoulder blocks, one after another. Neither man going off his feet. Great agility from the big man. A drop kick finally takes oh. Mendy down and he nips up. My God. More agility, flexibility. This man is a winner. Well, as we said at the top of the show, don't forget our main event tonight. Austin Aries defending the defiant world title against Travis Banks. Let us know who you think is going to win that one. Let us know what you think about this bizarre new appearance of Prince Amin. Give us your opinions on everything going on tonight using the hashtag WeAreDefiant. Simmons is finding this tough, you know. Look at Menzies, those overhead belly to bellies. Incredible. Well, Jörn Simmons made quick work of Alex Dunn. But here against Luke Menzies, you're right, Bradshaw, it ain't so easy. Menzies is uh, temporarily at least in control here. He's going to maybe try for a vertical suplex on Simmons. Simmons goes behind, uses strength, his leverage, and close on right into the throat of Menzies. Pastor William Ever just walked in front of our, the Ahinan position here, the commentary desk, and both Prince Amin and brother Liam followed. This, this is unbelievable, Bradshaw. Pastor William Ever, he is a force here in Defiant Wrestling, whether people like it or not. Slater and Amin, zombie-like in the way they are following Eva around the ring. They're not alone. Even I'm slack-jawed at what's going on around here. Well, you're easily led. You'll probably be the next one to join the congregation. No, oh, don't be silly. I couldn't go to church dressed like this. Come on. <laughs> no. I'm not sure any faith would have you. In any case, now you see Simmons trying to wear down Menzies, who came out of here explosively from the opening bell. Maybe some good strategy from the Dutchman to try and beat some of the air out of those lungs. Well, the thing that Simmons can boast, he's not only good at those big, rugged power moves, he's deceptively good on the mat too. The big Dutchman is someone to watch here in Defiant Wrestling. I think Jan Simmons is the kind of guy who could do so well on his own. I've, I've got to wonder, why is he bothering with someone like Pastor William Eva? He I, could I, dominate on his own. I'm not even sure it's a conscious decision at this point. Pastor William Eva, you see the way everyone follows him around. This man has a hold on everyone he comes into contact with. Well, Simmons got taken off his feet again there by Mendes. He's having an impressive showing here. Simmons is having to regroup, rethink his strategy. He's sent to the ropes again. Mendes will pick him up. Full away, power slam, goes for the cover. A two count, Menzies is getting closer. And and ringside, Eva looks a bit disappointed for lack of a better term, surprised and wait a minute. Don't tell me that Prince Amin is going to poke his nose in this match. Yeah, Amin's on the apron. Eva just told Amin to get on the apron. Menzies spots Amin, oh. Amin caught by Eva and Slater and uh, put back to earth gently onto his feet. Oh, Pastor William Ever calls for Simmons to finish it. It's a gut wrench power bomb from Simmons. That surely will do it, and it does. Jörn Simmons, your winner. Here is your winner, Jörn Simmons. Well, that is the second week in a row that William Ever, Pastor William Ever, has got involved in that way. And uh, 
cost one of his congregation's opponents a match. Now oh. what? You called it a flock. Dave Bradshaw, Pastor William Eber, building something. Congregation, whatever. It is a force. Very dangerous flock, and Menzies did well to get out of there. Saw what happened to Amin a few weeks ago. He was carried out of here. Now look at him. So anyway, Jan Simmons, victorious. As uh, William Eber, once again, playing the puppeteer for Prince Amin and Liam Slater. From strange to even stranger here on Defiant.